which is very easy. We just measure a half inch, cut and turn, half inch, cut and turn, half inch, cut and turn, and cut and turn one more time, and one more time, and finished. And now, nice sharp base there, so we'll add some more prime to that. And now we'll do that most famous of all pyro tricks, the seesaw method. We'll pick up first one side of the paper and go like that, and then the other side, and the other side. And you'll notice all those stars are tumbling, and they're picking up all that prime, and they're getting a nice uniform black color. Now, it's also rounding the edges slightly, which you don't really want, but you can live with it. It's not doing it that much. And what have we got? But a nice pound of stars, all primed. And all the stuff that's left in the bottom, like that, is called star crumbs. You can see the red stuff there. It's a combination of star mix and prime. All that has a very definite use as star filler. I can see, to be critical for a sec, that there's a little water showing here on some of the stars, which means I really made it too wet. Hard to decide how that occurred since the water was weighed so carefully. But nevertheless, our stars are now ready to be dried.